It's Sunday, the 27th of December. This is the News in 60 Seconds. In today's newspapers, the Planning and Statistics Authority has launched a cutting-edge mobile application called Qatar Statistics. The application is now available for free download on both Android and iOS operating systems and will provide users with a direct link to register and electronically complete the data of the Qatar Census 2020 in an easy, safe and fast way without the need for a field researcher to register households and individuals in the country. Several Qatari physicians publicly take the COVID-19 vaccine to urge others to follow. You don't need to urge me to follow. The moment I can have it, I will have it. And the largest theme park in Qatar is set to open for previews on December the 30th. Salwa Beach Resort offers a special preview of the Desert Falls Water and Adventure Park, one of the largest theme parks in the Middle East with amusement and adrenaline around every corner. Desert Falls will offer families and adventure fanatics an exciting sneak peek into a world of unlimited excitement and fun. Desert Falls Water and Adventure Park features 18 attractions and 56 rides and slides, including the water park's signature ride, the King Cobra. A very special preview ticket price of 150 reels and 100 reels for visitors under 1.2 meters in height will be exclusively sold for a limited time from a kiosk in Doha's Hotel Park next to the Corniche starting today and will be valid for admission from December the 30th. Now today's COVID update. In the last 24-hour period, active cases of COVID-19 have increased by 24 to 1,972. 6,529 COVID-19 tests were performed and just 2.59% of those tested positive. Of those testing positive, 59 were travelers who are now in quarantine. For all the information you need on Qatar, get Mahaba's amazing new e-guides. They're completely free of charge and available on their website, www.mahaba.qa forward slash e-guides. And that's all for today. Please take care and I'll see you tomorrow.